We're supposed to meet our dad at this restaurant since he pulled a no-show last time. Who's sitting here? You. So we decided not to tell mom he's coming, just in case he ditches us again. Can I just get you guys something to drink? Just give me some Patron. I just need a little bit of Jesus juice. You got a lot on your mind? <laughs> Hallelujah. My sisters have been working really hard on my dad coming to visit, and I'm cool with it. I'm just not ready for the emotional drama that's going to accompany that. It never goes well when my mom and my dad come together. Thank you. What kind of stuff do you have for kids? Like chicken fingers? What? Shirt? Guys, I'm so hungry. Are you hungry, Mom? I know you hate Mexican food. I'm just going to have a salad. <laughs> Daddy blew us off the last time we tried to get together. He better not do that again, because I done flew my ass way cross country to see him twice. And if he don't show up this time, I'm going to know something. <laughs> I nearly fell out of my chair when I saw my ex-husband walking through the door. Actually, I was a little pissed off because no one informed me, no one told me that he would be there. I'm trying to get to a point in my life where I'm really speaking to my father. I love him, but we're just not the same as we used to be. I need an extra shot in it. Hi! Oh, you look fabulous, Daddy. Look how much weight you've lost. Yes, my dad, and your granddad. This man have not taken the time to call his kids or even come see about his kids. And so, therefore, his grandkids does not even know him. He's a stranger, for God's sakes. I'm your grandson, and you're my granddad. Like you didn't know? No. Not. How you doing, Ms. A? Great. How are you? Fantastic. You're my Good to know. When I see my mom and dad and how cold they are to each other with just a hi, I know it's not going to go well. It's not going to be a good night. <laughs> I just need you to take a picture of the kids playing with daddy. I was watching how the grandkids were interacting with my dad, because of course they don't see him that often. And mommy was pissed off. Okay, mom, I'm glad I'm saved. No, I'm I would say some choice I'm words. I think it's very difficult for my mom to see anyone gravitating towards my father. I think she feels like he relinquished his rights to those family moments when he left. Hey, Dad. My can daddy sit right here real quick? But I don't care. That's, that's next to you. Sure, Daddy. Hey, Dad. Daddy. What about me? Can you sit right here with me? I got a couple Christian questions I need to ask you and Mommy at the same time. If you're married to somebody for 35 years, you would have to be good friends at some point. So I just want to know where my mom and dad's friendship ended. I just wanted to know really honestly. And mommy. What? What's the signs of a friendship like diminishing? Well, I'll tell you when I felt that the friendship was over. I found over? out Wait, no, no. the man was cheating when people were staying out. Well, you speaking about yourself too. Because no, I'm speaking the same about you. you. We all know why the marriage ended. I don't know why Tamar's asking such a stupid question, and of course it sets mommy off. You have come to home say all what? time of night. Yes, you do. Claim they go. That's a lot. They know better than that. Claim they've huh? been on the yacht playing golf. What? They're playing golf, all right. That's how I, when I know. When I found out about this other woman, I was devastated. I was married to my ex-husband over 30 years. I had to say, see ya. What about you, Papa? That's because people live in their fantasy world. Well, I don't think people are living in the fantasy world. Like that's the woman that's coming in, laying in your bed, screwing in your bed. That is not a that fantasy really world. Happen. That's for real. I don't know anything what? about that. You're a liar. And you a dirty liar. The nerve of him calling mommy a dirty liar, and he's the one who's been lying about his mistress for years. You think you had the perfect marriage, but you didn't have you know the perfect marriage. Not, wait, 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 how did she think she was perfect, Dad? Because everything she said she thought was right. Pitiful lie, too. And as long as you agree with her, she's fine. And it's the same thing with y'all. Oh, if y'all don't I agree with that... her, she is pissed. Oh. And it's time for y'all to stop letting your mother 
run your life. That's what I have to say. Like that thing. It's time for y'all to stop letting your mother run your life. Uh-uh. How dare he try to tell me how to raise my kids after he have abandoned us. He has some nerve. Y'all have lives to live yourself, and she can't run her life, her home, and your home too. And you know what? Had you been home long enough to help me to raise them, it wouldn't be such a problem. But where were you? What I'm there you hanging do? in the street what did you do doing all whatever day? you were what big enough to do. What did you do all day long? What did you do? What did you and do? What did you do? If the children did that, I provide a living for me? all of my children. But to, to okay, I'm going to say one thing. I'm the oldest child. I've been my past the longest. Mm -hmm. I think that daddy doesn't like mommy. And he hasn't. For and he while. hasn't for a long time. Yeah. Absolutely, possibly no reason y'all shouldn't have been friends. There's no way, because I got kids now, I get it. I agree with you. I brought through a separation, I, so I, I get agree it. With it's like y'all should be friends. But you can handle it wrong. You're going to hell for everything. Oh my God. After my parents got divorced, my father married a woman named Wanda just 30 days after my parents' divorce. 30 days. Why did you really get married? Yeah. Did you were lonely? Now, now, don't feel that I didn't have any feelings for Miss Wanda because I did. It's about time he acknowledged the feelings that he had for this woman while we were married, and especially in front of the kids. I was lonely. Wow, I never I heard you say I, that. I didn't have I didn't have my children around to support me and be with me. Daddy, but you didn't want us around. Her. Didn't... But I was very disappointed in my dad when my parents divorced because when he got his new wife, he forgot about us. He loves us, and but he forgot about us. He forgot that we were still part of his family. If right. I could go back and change things, I would have handled Bring it out. things. Don't do that. Don't say that. I don't want him to tell us he would do things differently when he really wouldn't have. The still end result would have been, and we still been divorced. That's you didn't the divorce me, I divorced you. Remember? Ooh. Yeah, you still would have, because I was tired of you running around and doing what you were big enough to do. And no, uh-uh, uh-uh, I, 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 I you wouldn't say mad to that. I never knew that. Your mommy filed. Mother filed. I filed. She did you didn't want a divorce? Wait, wait. She did. I asked to go to marriage counsel. We went to marriage counsel. You sit there and cry. Because the woman told you you had to stop seeing the woman. And you were wearing the woman ring. This whole thing, like, with you and mommy, like, not getting along, is so much beyond y'all little itty-bitty feelings. There got to come a time in your life you said, listen, I got to put some things aside because what it was is what it was and what it is is what it is. And you don't talk about the, the hurting thing. Let's talk but about... You, the you can't say that. Wait, no, 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 no. Because if you, have a, if you have a sore and you keep hitting on that sore, it's going to continue to hurt. But if there is a sore, if you... Take care of the soil. Right. If you take care of the soil, you can put the white heal. medicine on it for it to heal. A sore? Please. This man ripped my heart out. Let me stop right now. I'm going to ask y'all. What will heal this? No, 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 y'all, y'all know, y'all say you gotta do this, but I'm what sorry. we're here. I'm real sorry. I'm have sorry. you ever apologized? Have I ever? Yes. Yes, I have. No, he has not. Oh, oh that's a Lord. Lord. That's a line. But, that, but daddy, that's her opinion. She, I know, that's her you opinion, but that. it's not but true, you, She's supposed to let you have it, daddy. It was the first no, time no, y'all seen no, each other. No, okay, no, okay, no, okay, no, okay, no, okay, that's it, that's it, stop. Apologize. Daddy, you know what? You know what? That's wrong. I know I'm the one who wanted my parents to resolve their issues, but really, that is the lamest apology I have ever heard. No, a real apology. I'm not saying I'm sorry. It. It, it don't matter. Well, it's not just saying to say something. Yeah, wait, wait, wait. That was wrong right there. Why doesn't it matter? That's why. Why does it not matter? That was wrong right there. I'm perfect. Was, one, was Miss, Miss Wanda the only woman you were with? No. What y'all don't understand, Wanda was not always my lover. She was my friend. You was over there to your woman house that you were running that with for 10 long years. That was kicking it for 10 years, for real? 10 long years. Are you serious? 10 years. 
So you don't manipulate the children to accept your whatever she may be. So you don't speak to them for eight years. Do you but have she a relationship? Do you have a relationship? Don't you worry about Dennis, what I've got. Don't worry about I'm running that. And don't don't worry, you worry about my relationship. But she know that you lay it low and spread it wide. You don't care who it is. What? Now, figure that out. I had enough of his lying, his cheating, and his crap. And you know what? I better get out of here, because if I don't, it will be two sad days, the day they bury him and my trial. At this point, it's pretty clear that the dinner was over, and we're all just pretty drained from all the drama. Good hugs.